Thomas and Aaron D'Souza. I'm very excited for yeah, our, yeah. <laughs> I'm very excited for our first guest for our show. We have a comedian. He is part of the top um, top ten, or he's he's one of the finalists for the Brampton's Next Top Comedian. Let's give it up for Nicholas Ritzy. Hey. Hey guys. Oh my god, I'm so glad to be here on Rogers TV. What? Say hello to all 10 people watching. Yeah. Oh my god. Uh, I'm just glad it's summer now, especially in Canada here. Summertime's great because Winter time's over, it's fading off, well, it's pretty much faded off now, but you never know because in Canada it always comes right back, right? So it's like, I'm glad because, like, in winter time, every time I go somewhere that's like in the cold inside, it's like someone looks up and be like, hey man, your right hand looks pretty frosted. What? It's like, I have to explain to them, oh, it's through Paul and everything, it gets real awkward and everything. I can't say anything cool, I can't be all like, oh, Vietnam 72, man. Or, <laughs> Oh, Compton 1991 or something like that. I can't do anything like that. It's like, oh, that, and like I remember when I was a very little crippled boy and everything. I was like, mommy, I'm going to go to summer camp. My mom sent me to a summer camp of other crippled children. It's like a concentration camp for handicapped kids. Like, walking in the shower when water came out of the faucet, we were all disappointed. But nothing was as bad as the time when you normal people would come over and got really scared because you saw a crippled guy like me holding a bow and arrow at the archery range. Like, Ugh. But the worst night was when they had the huge bonfire, because I thought they were going to push us in. But no, no, they decided to sit us down and tell us spooky stories, like the one about the man with the hook for a hand and went after the teenagers down by Lover's Lane, or the man with the deformed leg that traveled through the woods and killed all the campers. And I'm all like, hey, hey, why the hell all these stories have a killer for a crippled person? You know, it's like, mm, come crap is that, man? And then like, but normal people kind of believe these stories are true, because I live right by a university, and I'm walking down the street, and I see these three hot girls walking towards me. So I'm all like, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> and they cross the street. I'm like, oh man, what the hell? And then I see three big black dudes walking towards me, and they cross the street too. Like, oh, come on! That's not how racism works. I was supposed to cross the street first. Ugh. Man, and then try and find a job. Another hard thing going on. Every job interview I go for, the same thing. They ask me the one question. So, Nicholas, what's your greatest weakness? Bullets, all right? Bullets. Man, like going to school was the worst for me because every school, I, like high school I go to and everything, I wasn't allowed on the bus. I wasn't allowed on the bus. You know how bad that is? Not be allowed on the bus. Where's Rosa Parks for me, okay? Like going on the bus. The only time I got to ride a normal bus was like field trips and everything like that. And guys, remember what we did on field trips? You're on the bus sitting down, you put down the window, you're on the QEW, let's say, you get the trucks going by. Put your hand out the window, get the trucks to honk their horn and everything. Trucks are honking their horns. The teachers are all like, keep your hands inside the bus. That one smart ass student in your class is like, Psh, why? My teacher just picked me up and be like, that's why. I was like, what the hell is that? What happened? <laughs> oh, that's so bad. <sighs> man, and then like, like in high school, they had the school dances and everything like that, man. I like, girls on one side, boys on the right side, they're all dancing and everything. I like to go up to the girls and dance. I ask them, the girl will be all like, uh. Other girls will be like, you gotta say yes to the crippled person. It's kind of bad luck if you say no, right? And like, uh. But the worst part of going to school dance is the YMCA song would come on, and everyone would wonder what kind of letters I would produce with my hands. If that song was Chinese, I would nail that song in a second, man. Thank you, guys. Thanks. Thank you so much for being here. Huh. So you're part of the finalists for the for Brampton's top, um, Brampton's next. Something like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah sure. Next comedian. So um, that's with Neil Griffin. Yeah. Awesome. And how long have you been telling jokes for? Oh. Okay. Now we got to do some math. Right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So we go back to November 2005, November 24th, 2005, and let's just so. So over 10 years. 11 years, I guess. But I was also in school, so I wasn't doing it like every day. Right. But it's more like 
after I finished school, I just had a job, which was very, a day job, which was very lenient on like, oh, fine, we'll let you do the nights mm -hmm. and everything, right? So then I started trying to try and do more and more sets. Amazing. Yeah. And you have a show coming up in August? Yeah. The Nubian Festival? Yeah, yeah the Nubian show. Nubian Kenny show. Robinson. Yeah. With who? Kenny Robinson. Oh, cool. Do you yeah. know who else is on the lineup? I have no idea. Just uh, that's all I know right now. Just be a he, surprise. It'd be a surprise. He could even kick me off. What wants? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and where can we find you online? Uh, Reese Vision for everything, really. Like oh, cool. Instagram, Twitter, uh, Vine, which I've completely abandoned because my phone does not have enough memory to hold all that. Oh, no. Yeah. I just like five gigs. Like, I need that 40 gigs. <laughs> How can I be socially networking? <laughs> right? So, yeah. Excellent. Thank you so much for being here, Nicholas. You're welcome. All right, so he's going to be joining us for the game afterwards. Please stay tuned. Take it away, Jay Can on the Nighttime Band.